Guys, I hope you are working. We are working out here, okay? We are working. We are almost to a thousand subscribers. If you're new, make sure you subscribe. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to Malik Mufasa channel. I think this is episode number 58. Well, it doesn't matter because we're getting this money like we always do, right? So today, we're going to talk about how to set up your Facebook pixel. All right, guys, let's get this video to 100 likes. If you're new, make sure you subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get all the updates on all the videos when I release them. Now, let's get straight into the video. All right, guys, so I'm going to teach you guys exactly how to install your Facebook pixel. OK, so what exactly is a Facebook pixel? OK, so a Facebook pixel is what you put on your site so that you can get data and collect data from your audience. OK, so whenever a person uh, views your content, when a person adds the cart, initiate checkout, search, purchase, all of that. Right. And then you can use you can target those events so that Facebook can grab all the right people and solve the right puzzle so that, you know, you don't have to be spending I know uh, blindly on ads and all that stuff. So Facebook pixel is so important, especially when you're starting off with Instagram influencers, which I recommend that you start off so you can build data and then you can, you know, start using your Facebook pixel to your advantage. So um, as you can see, this is the beat season store. Keep in mind, I don't focus on this store. This is just for YouTube so that you guys can learn and, you know, do all that stuff. It's just documenting uh, whatever this store does. But um, I have three other stores that I use my Facebook pixel on. And you can see all the events when you scroll down here. So you have your page view, your view content, your add to cards, your ad payment info, even your purchase. So as you can see, we have a couple of purchases just from running some Facebook ads and uh, probably testing some products or whatever. But um, we had about 37 add to carts uh, and 800 view content. So, I mean, it's not bad. So, you know, you can really study your data and see what's really going on in the back end of your store. And that's why a Facebook pixel is so important in the later in the future, you can actually target those customers and, you know, run, you know, maybe a retargeting ad for add to cart people and, you know, not for the purchases. So maybe if you want to run an ad to purchase, you can do a upsell to them or, you know, we can say that, uh, thank you for purchasing our uh, product. You know, maybe you want to purchase this. So, you know, it's a lot of different key factors that you can do with Facebook pixels. So I teach all of this in my course. I actually took a class on Facebook ads and stuff. So, you know, the course is really going to be revamped on the Facebook section. And if you're interested, make sure you get in before the price rise, because this is going to be some fire, fire content with Facebook ads. And so um, because remember, you want to start off with Instagram influencers. And once you get to Instagram influ or Instagram influencers and you transfer to Facebook ads, that's when you start scaling. OK, so it's going to be crazy. All right. So um, but in today's example, we're actually going to be talking about how to install your Facebook pixel so you can get started with all these events down here. OK, also, guys, you can actually do a lot more things with the uh, Facebook pixel. So you have custom audiences and custom conversions. So a lot of people are wondering what the heck is a lookalike audience? What the heck is a custom conversion? Well, you can actually use your pixel and let's say we want to make a lookalike audiences for all the people that actually purchased on our store. So let's say we have 100 people that purchase and we can actually make a lookalike audience in uh, Facebook so that Facebook can make the exact uh, you know features of those purchases okay and then I can run an ad with the lookalike audiences and then send it send my ad to those people so it's very very powerful okay and also with custom conversions you can actually create different conversions and look at your data and see what's actually working for your store so it's very very powerful Facebook pixel if you don't have a Facebook pixel on your site you are wasting your time okay you are not you know serious you're not in the ball game uh, with this drop shipping, Shopify, all this, you know, e-commerce stuff, you really need to have your Facebook pixel on your site. Okay. It's that simple guys. So how do you install your Facebook pixel? Well, once you go and make a new, uh, you know, Facebook ads manager or whatever your business manager, right? Then you're going to come down to pixels. Okay. So you're going to go to pixels and then it's going to take you to this page. And then, you know, if you have not installed your Facebook pixel, it's going to say, create your pixel down here. Um, it's going to take you to the same page, but in this example, I'm just going to click set up and it's going to take you to this page. It's going to say, install your pixel code. Okay. So 
what you want to do is actually integrate within Shopify. So it gives you a manual option or you can do an email to a developer or whatever. But the easiest option is to install on your Shopify store. So you click Shopify, then this button is going to come up. It's so easy. What we're going to do is actually go to our Shopify store. So then you're going to go into your uh, Shopify store and go to online store and scroll down to preferences. OK, you just click preferences. It's going to take you to this uh, section right here. So as you can see, I have my Google Analytics set up and then I have my Facebook pixel. OK, so uh, what you need to do is actually it's going to be blank for you. So all you have to do is actually get the code pixel ID from the Facebook manager It's either going to be right here or you can actually get it from right here okay so you can copy that just copy it and you just paste it in here okay so once you paste it then it's gonna uh you just hit save and then you, your facebook pixel is installed all right so now what you need to do is actually go on your site and register an event so you can actually click this you can go on your shopify store um and let's just click a product so as you can see we have our pixel helper up here what you need before you do anything make sure you have your facebook pixel helper installed okay this is a google chrome extension so you can actually see that you know what's really going on and if your pixel is actually working correctly okay so make sure you go to the extension all you have to do is just click this three dots go to um more tools then extension and then you could just search it um you can actually search it up here and all you have to do is just say Facebook pixel okay once you click Facebook pixel then it's gonna be the first one Facebook pixel helper you just download it and then you can actually go to your Shopify store and then you can have your events and see what's really happening and you know register it okay so you just click add to cart one time and you go back to your Facebook uh, manager pixel then you refresh it and it should register the event and your pixel should be ready to go okay so it's simple it's easy you know it's not that hard it's not that complicated just do if you have not installed your Facebook pixel go ahead and do that right now okay do it right now and you know you you can start running ads and you know studying your analytics and you know doing all that because you want to be studying your stats and your analytics this is how you get to that next level guys so i explain all of this in my course you know if you really want to you know take your game to the next level and really know how to you know run ads how to run proper ads and studying each uh you know event and what's you know what's so important in knowing all these things right you can actually get into my course it's 37 dollars. it's the best deal you're ever going to get okay so um don't take it for granted so um i hope this kind of helped you guys you know understand that you know facebook pixel is so important and uh, you know there's so many things you can do with the events and adding custom conversions and lookalike audiences you just have to implement all these things so that you can be successful and get to that next level so if you want to get into the course i actually teach all of this in my course and more you know if you want to run proper ads if you want to get you know the proper uh conversions and add to cards and view content and all that we go deep into detail with all of this so if you really want to get into the course the course is still at 37 dollars is the best deal you can ever get guys so all you have to do is just click the link in the description or hit me up on instagram or you can email me on my website so at the end of the day your boy is still here peace out